Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. The long-awaited review of uh, the fork mounted wind deflectors. Those guys, those guys on my 2020 electric light standard. About two, three months ago, I installed, while there was actually a snow on the ground, I installed these wind deflectors. If you haven't seen that video, uh, take a look over here or over here, I'm not sure, and see how the actual install was. Anyway, in this video, uh, I'm gonna be actually taking the bike for a ride. Well, as you know, the last two months I was away and I was away from my bike, I didn't have a chance to test them out. So this video is a ride review of the wind deflectors, see how they feel, see if they actually solve the problem of uh, the wind uh, buffeting that I was getting on my helmet. I uh, was forever searching for a solution how to stop all this buffeting. I know, true. If you don't want buffeting, I know, go in a car. Right, true. But there's a, there's a compromise. I do want to feel comfortable, be able to hear my music and to ride safely, calmly, without the noise, without the... It's very tiring when you... All that noise, the helmet banging all around. So I was looking for, uh, you know, some way to actually reduce my buffeting. Uh, there's a whole uh, search for the right windshield that I've done and the final uh, uh, the final solution that I think that I actually got nailed it is the wind deflector so I'm gonna take a ride see how it feels go take it to the highway see if it actually solved the problem just before we ride if you're new to this channel and want to watch more of my uh, reviews rides and fun stuff about Harley Davidson do me a favor, click the subscribe button. Make sure you hit that also the bell so you get notification every time I put out a new video. And if you enjoy this video, I appreciate it if you give me a, a little thumbs up over there. So uh, let's uh, hit the road. Oh yeah, some of you are asking after you saw my last video, the you know, getting back to the USA and with John's video. Some of you, your comments, first of all, they were very nice comments. Thank you so much. I appreciate uh, all the warmth, the love that you guys are showing. I really, it really warms uh, my heart. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, some of you actually commented that uh, you see that I lost some weight. Well, yeah, I've been, uh, the last two months, I've been uh, going uh, hard on keto, only keto, uh, keto diet. And since I was alone, I was doing a lot of sport every day, like six times a week. I was walking three and a half miles every day and some uh, exercise. So I dropped like uh, seven, seven eight pounds uh so that's the way keto and exercise every day okay it looks like it's set to video going to hit the road see if this this buffeting that i was experiencing all this time it's been redu been reduced significantly by the way with this uh, freedom shield which i installed uh, it's it's very good. I'm very happy with it. Endless searching for the proper. I went through Clockworks. I went through uh, some kind of uh, Amazon, a cheap Amazon thing. Finally came to you know to this uh, Freedom Shield, which is really good. So, I did remove uh, my soft lowers because uh, it's warm already and I want to get some uh, cooling to my uh, engine, to the motor, so that might bring a, a little bit of uh, wind on the lower part. But the main thing that was uh, annoying me was the buffeting on the helmet that was coming, I guess, from here. So we'll know very soon. Yeah, it's a nice day out. It's very nice. I think it's like in the 70s, 60s, 70s. I'm wearing just jeans on the bottom, short uh, sleeve shirt and my leather on the top, full face helmet, uh, and it's nice. It's a bit windy. I went out for a walk before with my wife and the dog took the dog out for a walk. Bike sounds great.
going 40, the visor is open. There's absolutely no wind in my face. But that's because of the windshield with the, you know, the flare, flare up. You know, one of the nice things of having a YouTube channel is uh, you do get a lot of a lot of offers, a lot of free stuff, I would say. Uh, so somebody actually uh, reached out. A guy that sells on the uh, Amazon uh, reached out and offered for me uh, offered me to to review, like uh, to review offered to review. Uh, a headlight he's gonna send out a headlight to me it's free obviously I mean you're not gonna pay for it because I'm already happy with the setup I have but he uh, he's sending out a LED one piece with a halo uh, ring around it for me to review I said sure uh, send it out and uh, I'll I should be getting it in the next few days I'll do a little install, do a video, show you how to install it, and compare between what I have right now and the new light, and tell you uh, what I think about it. I promise you, I'll give you my honest uh, opinion, my uh, my honest thoughts. I'll tell you the pros and cons of uh, of uh, of the light, and if I recommend, uh, if I recommend it or not. So I should be getting that in the next few days. Stay tuned for that come back uh, to the channel and uh, see that video we should be going uh, the next few days uh, for a ride John and I are going to uh, up uh, to New York State I'm not sure exactly where we're gonna go I think we're gonna start at uh, bikes and breakfast it's the first uh, Sunday of first Sunday of May so we'll, we'll start the morning over there say hello to people see you guys catch up uh you know with uh not being here for two months and seeing meeting up with people and we'll take a ride from there so i'm on the highway still the visor is open let me close the visor visor closed and i'll tell you when i'm up at highway speeds well, as you can see, I'm already at highway speeds. And this is really nice. My helmet is not uh, nodding, not wiggling around, not, not being hit with buffets. Let me go faster. This is nice. It's just really nice. It's actually working. See, the thing was that when I was uh, going uh, fast, high speeds, the helmet was was being thrown all over, and it was impairing my visibility, my vision. Small, you know, small buffets, small smacks of air on my on the usually on the top on the top of my helmet. Oh police yep but now it's pretty smooth wow okay I'm going faster than highway speeds and this is wow <laughs> this is smooth Oh my God, it solved the problem. That's really good. Wow, what a reduction in the buffeting. It's like, it's like there's one big, one big uh, bubble over here, a vacuum or like a still area. Let me put the music on, see if that, if I can actually hear the music louder. Well, yeah, I think it is actually, I can hear, I don't want to say louder, it's, but I can actually hear clearer. I can hear the, the music. I'm turning it off. 
off the highway and I got to tell you these wind deflectors are very effective absolutely very interesting <laughs> I came over to uh, the inner roads little twisties in suburban New Jersey now I'm gonna hit back uh, the highway again and see again test it out see if these deflectors uh, give them another chance like uh, on this highway I don't know sometimes you know one highway if there's uh, you know like trees on the side there's different air movement uh, than uh, an open highway. So let's, let's give this highway a chance as well. Try it out. See how this does. I expect it to be the same. It was, it was very nice. It was very effective. I mean, I don't understand the, uh, the aerodynamics of this little wing over there. This little flap over here. I don't know what it does. I know it, it from its design. It seems like it channels, it channels the air from uh, the bottom, from the fork, fork area, all the way up over the fairing. I don't know. Whatever it is, it's working. on my ways so I can see if there's a cop. Oh man, this is great. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, absolutely, absolutely working. So am I happy with this? Yep, a hundred percent. I installed the Harley, the Harley brand ones. I know there's some generic or uh, I don't want to say knockoffs, but uh, other uh, manufacturers that would probably cost half of the price. Actually, I'll try to search, uh, search up a few items, like a few of these deflectors, even deflectors and put them down by the links. So you guys can try them out. I didn't try them out. I'm only trying, I'm only uh, rocking these Harley ones. But uh, in my eyes, it's just like it's aerodynamics. One design is pretty much the same as another, I would assume. So, I mean, I did see, I did read uh, reviews and saw some videos of people that you can't uh, find too many of these reviews uh, but the people that did install them said they were very very efficient not everybody is crazy about the look it made John made fun of me says dude it looks like like a Batmobile because it makes the bike the fork area look wider Well, that's a matter of taste. Anyway, they're very efficient. Like literally, there's no buffeting whatsoever right now. That's it, I'm always, almost home. Short ride, but fun. Tomorrow we should be going out for a morning ride, like I said to bikes and breakfast and from there upstate to New York put some miles on the bike okay guys I'm really close to the house uh, let me jump let me jump now uh, to my conclusions and then uh, we'll jump back to here now I just got back and I uh... I'm really impressed with these uh, wind deflectors. I don't again, like I said before, don't ask me how uh, how they work, why they're effective, why, like what's the aerodynamics behind it. 
but uh, my suspicion or my my understanding or thought is probably uh, air that would go over here and I don't know air that would go probably air probably air wind that would go over here and then vacuum up through here uh, up to the helmet area to this and, and give you the buffeting probably is being channeled with this uh, wind deflector being channeled up and through the fairing over like over the helmet anyway in any case I really like them uh, as I said before a matter of taste whether you like uh, you see it does make uh, make the bike look a little bit wider over here um, I don't mind it I actually like it I like it it adds that chrome look to it and in terms of the effectiveness like I said before really good so do I recommend them absolutely these specific are Harleys uh, again I'll search if uh, I can find uh, something that's more or less like it and put a link down by the description. Uh, but I did not, uh, I did not try any other thing. I'm only trying the Harley, Harley ones and I really like them. So uh, back to the end of the ride. So that's it guys. Uh, thank you so much again for stopping by, uh, listening and watching my video. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you enjoyed it, please do me a favor. Give me a thumbs up over there. If you're not subscribed to the channel want to watch uh, more of my videos go ahead and click that subscribe button make sure you hit that bell so you get notifications every time a new video drops i am sandy from holy shift till the next video peace out guys